with a woman who can answer the question, how do you create a job? She will do Connecticut proud as our next U.S. Senator. saw that, that Governor Christie was actually in Connecticut last night uh, with our next governor, Tom Foley. going to be a governor for Connecticut, like Governor Christie is for New Jersey. Tough, standing up for the people, not special interests. But we're not going to be able to do this without each and every one of you. All of us are in statistical ties right now with our opponents. And so every door that you knock on, every phone call that you make, is going to make the difference between a Senator McMahon and, God forbid, a Senator Blumenthal. <laughs> So in the next 18 days, get out there, keep volunteering. I can promise you with my race that for all of your hard work, you will get huge dividends. Because by November 3rd, you will hear that sweetest phrase, House Minority Leader, Nancy Pelosi. Thank you all. Everyone, please welcome David Cappiello. everyone for coming this evening, and I especially want to thank our great mayor of the city of Stanford, Mayor Mike Fabio. I also want to thank our host for this evening, uh, someone who I have a great deal of admiration for, uh, someone who I worked for many years ago in the early 90s. I served with in the House of Representatives, and when I served the State Senate, he presided over uh, the Senate chamber. Uh, a great man, an Italian immigrant who truly lived the American dream, who built a business, created something in America, and I cannot wait. You can hear you back there, so please give a round of applause to Lieutenant Governor Michael Fidelli. Another great candidate, Linda McMahon. 